Hello, welcome to Chris's Beer Reviews. How are you? Hope you're doing really well. We're time for a beer review and we're off to, uh, well, we're going to be reviewing one of my favourite kind of styles of beer and that's uh, a smoke beer. I'm out of breath. I've just run up the garden because it's pouring down with rain. <laughs> it's one of the smoke beers from the Echt Schenkerler. This is the Echt Schenkerler Rausch Beer Fassen Beer. Uh, it's their vintage edition, hence it's got the, the gold sort of top and it's from 2018 their 2018 vintage uh, these are fantastic beers if you've never had a smoked lager you've got to give them a try i've reviewed a couple on my channel one of them was absolutely outstanding and i imagine this is going to be the same really so uh, let's get this one open that came off uh, very nicely um i probably I might if i remember is i'll attach a link to a really good youtube video all about the brewery and about how these are brewed in salt caves great little video it's only sort of about nine minutes long i think but it really explains the history of it and where the name Schenkerler came from which is quite interesting but i'll attach that link if i remember but yeah it's an interesting video i'm not one to talk about breweries in their histories there's lots of other good channels that do that i just like to drink beer and review it so this should smell like smoked pork ham barbecued pork is what this should smell like but it looks fantastic lovely head god there's certainly some floaty bits in there blimey there's some big floaty bits in there really carbonated lovely head nice sort of light tan head but boy it's in uh, another chris's beer reviews glass bits frosted my logo so you might not be able to see it um but yeah there's some there's some huge floaty bits in there let's go in for the sniff <laughs> such a great smell what an aroma you don't there's no other beers that smell like this it's, oh. it's a smooth smoked barbecued pork you can get you get the aromas of the wood the smoked wood the smokiness of the wood because they smoke the malts or dry the malts using real wood real wood using wood <laughs> Um, I can't remember what wood they say they use. Is it ash or beech? I can't remember. But you get that. You get that sitting around a campfire type aroma. And you get that lovely smokiness. There's almost apple in there as well. Yeah, like a spiced apple. It smells glorious. Let's crack on. Let's drink this. All those huge bits are down near the bottom. I'm not sure I really want to drink all of those. But there's still more in the bottle. Anyway, cheers. Let's crack on. Oh, that's good. 5.5% mm. ABV. I'm not sure if I said that or not. That is glorious. Let's get some more in. So smooth. Such a beautiful body to it. It's very full bodied, but it's very, very smooth. That's a huge head. Remarkably, remarkably drinkable for something that has such a prominent smokiness to it. But like compared it, comparing it with the other Shen curlers, this is a lot softer. It all feels softer, and that's probably because it, it's been aged. It's a 2018. It doesn't feel as aggressive as the the normal range of Shen curlers, which are all fantastic beers. This one just feels a lot smoother, a lot more of a a bigger mouthfeel, and that smokiness is it's obviously it's there but it just seems what's the word i'm looking i don't know it just <laughs> it just feels kinder than the other ones on the mouth it's just smooth it's gentle that smokiness is smooth and gentle and you get the lovely malt flavors in there they come out really well and it just works so well with that smoky taste that kind of porky taste that barbecue feel and as you're drinking it you kind of almost feels like you're sniffing at the same time it, it just hits all the senses so you've, it's like sitting around a, a fire with some really nice wood just burning away but not smoking a load so you're not inhaling it all and you just get that odd waft of smoke and that's what you get on the taste it kind of just wafts around in your mouth that beautiful smoke taste of the lager the beautiful malts that are in there lovely carbonation 
great body, great mouthfeel. Has got a small bit of finish, but that smoke just goes all the way through it. And there is a, a sweetness to it that's a bit caramel, almost toffee-like sweetness that runs through it. Some of those roasty malts and that smokiness and that little kind of meaty flavour you get, it just works a treat. You do kind of pick up on a bit of spiciness as well. I mentioned the apple in the aroma, you don't really get that on the taste. It's just an absolutely glorious beer. Uh, I picked this up from Trembling Madness, had an order turn up today. I uh, got this in the fridge this morning and I'm reviewing it straight away because I just knew it was going to be a belter. And it is the mouthfeel, once it's gone, pardon me, pardon me, you still get left with a lingering flavour in your mouth and it's fantastic, a nice delicate flavour left in your mouth. 5.5% you could put it in the session category however I've never sessioned the Shen Curlers uh, I just think for the way they taste and that smokiness I think you're in for an awful awful headache in the morning if you session those so I never do I almost have them as a bit of a, a kind of a treat really uh, they're just fantastic they're to be enjoyed not sessioned absolutely glorious beer picked up like I say from Trembled Madness £6.40 I believe £6.40 worth every penny damn good beer. I'm all done. See you on the next one. Take care. Bye.